My name is Toby Okechukwu, and I represent an area of Goji River Federal Constituency from Enugu State. Mr. Speaker, honorable colleagues, the issue of AMCON is quite weighty, and it is not the regular uh, practice of any parliament to make laws that have a lifespan. In this case of AMCON, a law was made for AMCON that should have a lifespan. And what mischief, you know the mis you're, you're, you're a man of letters and a legal person, the mischief rule in lawmaking is what defect do you want to kill? And what defect did the idea of having a lifespan for AMCON, what is the, was it intended to cure? We should not advertently or inadvertently encourage the situation where the intended mischief is negated or the cure we want to enforce is negated. In this instance, the way AMCON is carrying on, it is operating in a form and manner that looks like it has perpetual succession. That it is going so to, is supposed to act or stay forever. And that is why the liability to which they are supposed to sort out continues to linger. They continue to expand the cost. I think whereas the, the bill is to go for second reading, we should interrogate the deliverables which they are supposed to achieve. And in the debate led by the sponsor of the bill, that should have been brought forth. The principles creating the justification for the expansion or extension of from 10 years to additional year. And this stated period for the extension is not stated. Is it forever or for a period? It's very, very important, Mr. Speaker. So that we don't encourage a situation where, you know, it's a laser face situation where people are continued to expire liabilities and suddenly people are absconded, leaving assets that are less than the value of what is supposed to uh, to, 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 to be recovered. Then, Mr. Speaker, there are reasons why statutes, you know, uh, lim uh, have a, 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 I mean, uh, when to, something should become a statute bad situation, or wh why you are given a time frame to register. Mr. Speaker, this thing has to do with due diligence. A prudent, a, 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 a prudent agency or arm of government, or even a private person who has gone to court to obtain the judgment, if you don't register it within the time frame, it should be started by. You cannot give perpetual uh, lifespan, you know, uh, arrangement where somebody can go and register at any time. Otherwise, it will be subject to mischief and trading. People can begin to trade with it, and if that constraint is not sustained, and we cannot advertently make exceptions in laws where, you know, you encourage some conflict of laws, where in some jurisdiction they are statute bad and then you have exceptions. No. We can, a, 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 an entity that has a lifespan cannot even inadvertently be given a clause that allows it to play. So I think we need to be careful in extending that you can register, if you obtain a judgment, you can register it in two years or three years. No. There has to be a time limit. And it has to do with due diligence. We created the Banking Act. And now, you see a laser face situation where there is intervention, like the CBN is running a parallel economy. What uh, 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 
the chairman of judiciary raised is very important. Even when it has been passed around and we've not read it, members should be encouraged to interrogate it so that we have knowledge-based impute into our statutes and legislation. So I think whereas the intentment is okay for the entity to operate better, at the public hearing, some of these issues for amendment that have been raised, they ought to be interrogated to ensure the quality of delivery. And I do not think a situation why, where AMCON will have a, any extension cannot be up to 10 years anymore. It has to be, they must have to account for what they are supposed to deliver within the last 10 years. And what was the justification for the initial 10 years? What is the justification for this extension that has no time limit? So I thank you so much, and uh, I think you should go for second reading so that Nigerians and the public will have the opportunity of uh, interrogating the clauses. Thank you very much. Your main points. But what is curious to me, what I would like to interrogate is why, because you know, what you're talk, talking about in, in, in law is a sunset clause when you, when you have legislation that sets a time, uh, a time frame. But the question for me is why was AMCON even given 10 years in the first place? Because for me, I, I, I don't think there should be, should have been um, such, a, such a limitation because what is the work of, what is the, what is the functions of AMCON? Is it that after 10 years, what AMCON was supposed to do no longer exists in Nigeria? You see that uh, the, the, the cure, everything has been cured in perpe perpetually. I don't think so. Those things will continue. People will continue to owe banks. Bank people will continue to default. Uh, so I, I don't know that. Um, and in the area of registration, I don't understand how you can say, if I get a court judgment, my ju court judgment uh, becomes a nullity because either by indolence or whatever reason, that I, there can be a myriad of reasons, I am unable to register in six months. How can that make my court judgment uh, not only what if, especially in the climb we operate, what if the, where you go, there are bottlenecks, there's red tape, there's bureaucracy, or there's intentional delay, even at the registry, to stop you from registering, knowing that after six months, your judgment becomes a nullity. So there are many sides to this uh, thing, and uh, we must look at it. And I totally agree with you. You raised some very interesting points. So I think it should be, all those things should be interrogated at the committee level. Uh, so we'll just put a question. Those in support, please say aye. Just again, please say name. The ayes have it.